is in session. We're so happy that this woman is here. Emmy winning actress, writer, creator, Quinta Brunson is with us now to talk about the new season of the hit AB sitcom, Abbott Elementary. You have major fans right here who can't Thank wait to hear you. every plot point. But before we get to it, congratulations. Thank you so yes, much. Yes, you yes, made, you made Emmy history. I just yeah. want to brag on you. Um, first black woman to win in over 40 years yeah. for Best That's Actress incredible. in a Comedy Series. Yeah, pretty well. I didn't know that until after the fact. Um, I was just emotional at winning, of course, but then after, um, you know, when you get backstage and you do like the little actor press conference thing, yeah. Um, that was that information was given to me and that made me emotional all over again. Okay. How so, did you celebrate? Do you remember? I, <laughs> I, I, I went out with my, my friends and family um, and I had a good time. That's all yeah. I'll say <laughs> on the new well show. Well deserved. We're yeah. so happy for you. Thank so you. happy. I just got a fanboy for a second here because I just absolutely adore this show. I think Thank because you. it has so much heart, yep. right? So much heart and I think your relationship with your cast members is yeah. so evident, yeah. especially Cheryl Lee Ralph. Yeah. She had her own memorable win. Mm -hmm. but she was so proud of you, and you could see that pride. Yeah. What did she tell you after that? Afterwards, she just told me that she always knew this would be the case, that she was just proud of me, which is important to me as a, as a writer and, and creator, which is, to me, just as important as, you know, getting the award for acting, which I'm so grateful for. It's also wonderful that my cast and, and people like Cheryl recognize the show overall and I, I really felt like that win that night felt like a win for my entire cast mm. and crew. We all work so hard on the show so whenever whenever any of us gets to take an award home it feels like all of us winning so yeah. And Cheryl's gonna be on GMA I later know. this week. Yes. What should we ask her? You should ask her how she does it because <laughs> <laughs> I came in from New York or sorry I came in from LA to New York two days ago and I'm still reeling from the plane ride. Cheryl travels like nobody's business all the time and she still shows up hi darling yes. <laughs> so wait, how are you not sleepy I her energy's insane incredible it's yeah so just ask her how <laughs> <laughs> we, will, we will get answers on that tell us about season three season three is so exciting to me um we have a shortened season because of the wga and sag strikes we have 14 episodes and i really wanted to make sure every single one was packed with a punch because we only have so much time with our audience. But it naturally forced the writers and the cast to want to put on incredible performances for each episode. Um, I think there's some major changes this season Ooh. that we're always going to be there for the third season, but because we had this shortened um, episode count, it was even more important for me to give audiences something exciting to come back to, but not too exciting. You'll still see your familiar favorite teachers in Philadelphia and on TV, but um, I think there'll be some fun surprises. That's a good tease right there. Yeah. This gives everybody a sneak peek of tomorrow night's yes. episode. I was thinking over the summer while I was spending time with myself and just thinking about like what really <sighs> led me to this point Get in my life. Get to the point. Get to the point. Yes. Okay, so a career day. I think we should do career day at the school because I checked and we haven't had one since the only jobs for women were typists, moms, and wet nurses. I think it'd be a great way for the kids to see all the amazing jobs they can have and that's it. That's my idea. I'm done. Career day. <laughs> we just love so your character. And, and so I'm really excited that we have some fun guest stars this sh I forgot. We have like a murderer's row of guest stars, which is really exciting. I can't wait for people to see them. Well, you're, oh. you're, te you're teeing up my question. Oh. So, uh, so <laughs> are you going to give us any of them? Because we've heard like Hannah Waddingham from Ted Lasso, oh. like literally <laughs> made a, a plea. Um, I got to get Hannah on. She's so tall and so British. <laughs> I just don't know how to fit her in right, you're right. to the yeah, world. But we be. Just like tall British lady. <laughs> <laughs> but she's so lovely. We love Hannah so much and she's so sweet and so supportive. So one day okay, I, I so gotta figure it out. She's not on this new season, but no. can you tell us anybody who is? You call it a murderer's row. I like that. I can't tell you. Well, you got to see in that clip, there's a wonderful actor, Josh Sagara, who is on a show called The Other Two that I oh, loved. Yeah. He's a comedian in Powerhouse. So good. We have him this season, and he's with us, a recurring guest star oh, role. great. Fantastic. Benjamin Norris, who's a friend of mine, who's on the show Never Ever Ever, but also like is I, one of my closest I'm friends. I'm obsessed with that show. I know. <laughs> and so we have them, and Camilla is also playing. They're playing school district members. They're all with us. So I can tell you about them, and that's only because you just saw them in the clip. Okay. But I cannot <laughs> wow. tell you anything else. Tough. <laughs> 
you can tell us why I love how you're paying it forward. Tell us about this national tour. Oh, this is my favorite thing. So every season we've been able to, uh, with our marketing department, who's wonderful, find a way to give back to the teachers who inspire us so much. This year we did the Lunchbox tour. It's called the Lunch Break. It is a huge truck that I still don't understand the physicality of. I can't wait to see it in person. Um, it's a big lunch box that is traveling the country right now, and it is carrying supplies and free lunches for teachers and students. It's really cool. If you see it, it's amazing. please tag me. <laughs> I can't wait till it gets to LA so I can see it myself because I don't physically understand how it's working. I don't know where the windows are, but it is legal. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. Question, what what yes. would you tell the kids in a real career day about what you do? I would tell them that I make television. And if they had any more questions, I would say, I'm a producer. That means that I use my vision to get a wonderful group of people together to make some very compelling TV that they can watch on ABC and then also <laughs> stream on Hulu the next day. Oh, we love that commercial right there. Oh, God. Yes. But, you're, but at the end of the day, you're also a phenomenal writer. Thank and that's you. what sets the show apart. Thank I just think so the writing much. is so clever. Mm -hmm. We've talked about it. Thank you, uh, thank you so much for being with thank us. Thank you for having me. It's always fun to come here. I, and, I appreciate it. And anything else you want us to ask your, your colleague, <laughs> just whisper in our ear. I will. I will. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so you'll, everybody will have to watch that. Abbott Elementary, season three premieres this Wednesday, 9 p.m. Eastern on ABC. Streams the next day on what? On Hulu. Oh, yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> and as we said, co-star Cheryl Lee Ralph will be joining us Wednesday. Buckle up. Yeah. She always brings it. Yes, yeah, she does. Um, <laughs> and coming up, we are...